Hello everybody, welcome back to The Witcher 3, as you remember yesterday, um, we were helping out Kira a little bit more, and then at the end we sort of said we didn't have enough time, well it turns out that we kind of need to do all everything we can in order to get her to help us, so um, yeah, I'm back with her and uh, her from the other social lodge, but no, she was going to show us something, you so gonna show she was going to show, show us. Yes, but you weren't interested. Changed my mind. <laughs> then shoo, outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable? Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on. Obviously, out. we've got to be careful because you know we're friends with Yennefer, and we don't want to uh, muddle with other people. You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. Huh? If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said mm. almost. Now, don't interrupt. <laughs> there That's bounce. quite a good point. To it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. Hmm. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So where did... Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A Zugul cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole, left behind one slipper, so... I beg you, not another word about Zugul's. Now, to return to the fairy tale, I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't mm. need a fairy godmother. I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a Prince Charming. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Vellum. So, what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? And dinner? <laughs> no, Chicolo, right, we need to be very careful. Very, very careful. Um, Sounds yeah, tempting. With pleasure. So tempting, I don't think I can refuse. So, we'll take the offer. Before we go... There's one more thing. Got to transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Very Cinderella like. Well, why not? Let's see what you Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gavella Glan. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Well, I might also have changed hmm. your hair colour while I was at it. I've always fancied dark-haired men. Oh well, any port in the storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Last one there does the dishes. Hmm. Giddy up. Race Kira to the meadow. Okay. We're dressing up nicely for basically a picnic, which is confusing me because obviously why are we going for a picnic in a meadow in such nice gear? Why do we need such nice horse? So I wonder whether it's going to be... Well, I mean, this is very picnic-y, isn't it? This is the sole dead-looking swamp. Get away from her a little bit more again. Oh, oh that, that oh spiked her a little bit there. Let's just body check her for a few, for a few. Uh, there we go. We're sure we can. It's quite a long race. And I don't know. Oh, here we go. It's like the Mad Hatter all of a sudden. Not Cinderella. <laughs> Congratulations. You'd make an excellent jockey. If mm, only I were you. a foot shorter and five stone lighter. Well, yes. But then I'd not have invited you here. 
Now do you see why I needed those substances? Hmm. Beef and cinnamon and cloves, roasted capon with shallots. It was worth the trouble. Shall I pour the white or the... Dry red. But let it breathe a little first. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think <laughs> witchers suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cock or gander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. Hmm. How, well, if you don't mind my asking? We need to find out. I mean, you'd think the only work to be had in Velen would be in farming. <laughs> Very true. So, I have two options. I can either start cultivating turnips or leave. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first curse I've lifted. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. Hmm. Didn't destroy that workshop if that's what you're asking. Didn't see any reason to. If Alexander's findings were to fall into the wrong hands. Although, Fike Isle has a terrible reputation. None even dare go there. Perhaps there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm sorry. Perhaps, and we hope. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends? With benefits. So? Hmm. Well, we're going to be honest with her. There sorry. is. There's, you know. there's someone else. <laughs> so what? Oh, Geralt, Geralt. You're so old-fashioned. Will you at least lie down and gaze at the stars with me? Hmm. Why not? I don't know whether she's going to trap us. So I, I don't want her to. I really don't. Um. Know what they call that constellation in Zeracania? Dragon something, I bet. <laughs> no. It has a different name. Bit indecent, actually. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. Egfain Nave. Has she done some magic on us? Because it'd be horrible if she does. Kira? Where? Put me to sleep with a spell. Means she's up to something. Fike Isle, the tower. Hmm. I mean, she wouldn't have put us here unless she wanted to drop it in. I'll take care of it. Right, so let's quickly. Secondaries. Do we have any. Yeah, here we go. Okay, let's just. Let me just have a look. Treasure hunts. We have one treasure hunt in Tamarian. Which hunt? Contact the Phantom of Elbert. It's so level 17 in Skellige. Okay. I know what Kira's doing in the tower. Here we go. We want to be doing this. And obviously, as uh, if you don't already know, the latest DLC has been bought out. So I, d I definitely intend on getting those. Obviously, Blood and Wine is the latest. I will be. I won't bother getting it until because at the moment it's about 20. Uh, Twenty pound. I'm not. It's not that I can't afford it. It's that I'd, you know, quite like to um, get the other one when it's when it's a little bit cheaper and it's obviously the earlier one. So what I'll probably what I'll be doing is as soon as I can, I'll be buying the uh, buying the latest one. Um, obviously, when we need to. So there's there's two current DLCs. So I'll be buying the first one. Uh, we'll play through that. And then when that's done, we will get hold of the next, or the latest one, Blood and Wine. I can't remember what the first one's called, but it says it on the, uh, says it on the, no, it doesn't say on the, but I'm sure I can find out. It's 
quite an old Mott and Bailey style castle. Which is in there, but you can tell there's all the flames as though she's burning it. Is there no way we can kind of fit ourselves in a little bit closer? No, nah, this will do. Because apparently we can just jump over those wooden spikes and they don't hurt us one bit. Oh, oh god, come on, jump. Ah, here's a gatehouse. Ooh. A light. Top floor of the tower. Hmm. I'm gonna have to see what she's doing and hope that it is her. Thanks for asking. How are you feeling? Sleep well? Well, she you did use it. Me. Oh, please. I merely seized an opportunity. If I'd known you just wanted Alexander's notes, I'd never have helped you lift the curse from Fike Isle. All right. Perhaps I wasn't completely honest. Didn't quite toe the line. But I knew you'd manage. You're so manly and all. Geralty Poo. Wipe that frown off your face, or I might think you don't like me anymore. Hmm. Didn't come here to play games. I want to know what you're up to. Naturally, you suspect me of the worst. I don't deserve that. My intentions are pure, like a virgin's tears. Hmm. Alexander was studying the Catriona Plague. I'll use his notes to produce medication, perhaps a cure, or at least a vaccine. Mm -hmm. Strictly humanitarian motivations, is that it? No, strictly selfish ones. The mighty would pay willingly for such a remedy. Can you imagine mm. how much? Take Radovid, for instance. Why, he might even consider forgetting my past associations with the Lodge. Radovid doesn't does forget, it. and Radovid doesn't forgive, especially when it comes to sorceresses. He'll make an exception for me. He'll have to. I have something he wants. Please, you don't believe that. Well, you believe Yennefer will stop treating you like a dog someday. Don't see me laughing. I'm going to see Radovid. Tell him of this research, whether you like it or not. Hmm. Well, it this is suicide. is suicide, Kira. You'll wind up tied to a stake, burned to bolster the morals of the masses while entertaining them. So it looks like we might Shut have to help Shut up for a her. moment and look at me. See this? Bedbugs, Geralt. Bloody bedbugs. I, Kira Metz, advisor to Foltest, a member of the Lodge of Sorceresses, have bedbugs. Think what you will, but I'll not stay in this bloody swamp one day more. Not one day. I shall cross the pond tower, and that means Radovid's men will find me sooner or later. Don't you understand? Mm. I don't have a choice. I will have to parley. Well, Got another let's see if you go. Go to Care Morhen. You believe I'd be safe there? No, the opposite. When I get there with Siri, I expect we'll have to battle the Wild Hunt. Unbelievable! Have you even been listening to me? Closer than you think. Hmm. You're not looking for safety. You want your dignity back. You want to be Kira Metz, sorceress of the Lodge, not some healer from the swamps who reeks of manure. Hmm. Giving you an opportunity Radovid won't give you. Go to Care Morin. Show everyone what you're made of. Yennefer was right. You do have some notion of what women want, how they think. <laughs> well, we'll see. So, see you at Kaer Morhen. Bed's free of bed bugs, mostly. <laughs> I hmm. long to be there already. Well, one of them's see out the window, thanks to Yennefer. 
Okay, let's, um... So, we've helped everyone in. And we've got Emir, and we've got Skelliger, we've got Novigrad. So we either need to go to Novigrad or Nilfgaard. So let's see, Nilfgaard is... Oh, it's going to take us to the bloody... So, let's see here. We can either go down to Nilfgaard, or we can go up to Novigrad. Skelliger IR. Oh yeah. Um. Hmm. Let's go here. Uh, oh shit! Let's go. Let's go talk to em Emperor. The curse that held him up proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest. I get this every time I load in. And it's fine. It reminds me, but when I'm doing recording, it pretty much every day. It, it's just annoying. It's the same thing. Same loading screen every time. Then hidden her away. <laughs> hey, it's a long one. Mm -hmm. What can I do for you? I won't mean to speak to things. Big changes afoot in the Empire. You've no notion? The Emperor summoned you. He only ever summons with reason. It's clear he seeks his daughter. You know a lot. I must. I am my father's son. What's your father got to do with this? Um, he is close to the Emperor. And knows the opposition. Knows they press for abdication. Seeding the throne to Cyrilla, it's the best the Emperor can do. But, as is known, an Empress needs an Emperor at her side. My father will ensure the right man is chosen. Hmm. And he obviously assumes oh well. that it's going to be him. Okay, we need to go talk to Emery about Emerys. I love the fact we can just kind of... Can we not steal these ar I, I wish I could steal some of that armor. I mean, it, I know it's Nilfgaard, but... Your Imperial Majesty. Witcher, why have you come? I've managed hmm. to find out where Ciri is. Finally, I'd begun to doubt the wisdom of enlisting you. Bring her here at once. The Wild Hunt's pursuing her. Kaer Morin's the only place she'll be safe. That was not a suggestion. I can defend my own daughter. Hmm. Well, I we don't, don't doubt, doubt it. it. Against conventional foes, the Wild Hunt's different. Facing it here would put Vizima at risk. Hundreds of innocents could die. Kaer Morin is in a wilderness, and your army stands to be far more helpful there. Hmm. Agreed. I shall send a banner with you. On one condition, General Voris will lead it. Hmm. Can't agree to that. And I cannot agree to witches commanding my troops. Well, I'm not about to give in. You don't look it either. Sorry hmm. to take up your time, Your Majesty. Bring me Siri. Give us troops. If that's what she wants. Well, he obviously doesn't want to help. So we're going to be going to Novigrad now. Maybe we didn't persuade enough. Jump over the window lights. I don't know what I was doing there, to be honest. Ah, Geralt! What can I do for you? 
let's, let's right. In Hello. the notion of Siri, let's go back one more time and see if we can change our call. See if we can get him to send him. I mean, he's not the worst person in the world. I know it wouldn't be good to lead, but when I wish to speak to you. I shall have you summoned. Hmm. And um, it's not like we're going to turn up. We're independent people. We're independent people, us witches. We don't turn up to your calls just when you want. We do it when we have time. Okay, so we've got to talk to Chris, Dijkstra, Zoltan. And Roche. Um, let's do. Oh shit! I'm gonna do that. Let's go to Roche's today. As he told you, there, there comes the loading screen again. So what we're gonna do is, we're going to say we're gonna help out Roche and see where we can go from there. Avalach, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt. Then hidden her away on the Isle of Mist. It's also funny because that picture's meant to be um, Vesemir and my, uh, ourselves as Geralt and Yennefer. And it doesn't ever seem that way. Okay. Yeah, fuck off. Which. Okay, where actually is he? We'll pay for the free to me. Damn the blackens. You've been here. I can't actually tell where he is. Okay, let's oh. there, okay. So he wants us to go in here. To the left. I didn't care that didn't realize there's a gap around here. Hey Vernon. Good old friend. Geralt of Rivia. Safe and sound. Hmm. Well. Could use your help at Kaer Morhen. Aim to take Ciri there. Wild Hunt's bound to appear soon after. Geralt, we've known each other for a while. You know I'd never turn you down normally. But right now I have some troubles. A hideout that is no more, a weapon shipment that failed to make its destination, and Vess drilling a hole in my gut. Hmm. I'll go nowhere until I resolve at least the last. Well, of let's help Roche. Mm -hmm. Could use your help well, at Care More. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. I clicked the wrong one. Geralt Come on. Mentioned you have a Mentioned problem. Have there we go. Mm -hmm. It's Vess. She took a couple of lads across the river. She plans to hit the black ones at Mulberdale. So, sounds about like what guerrilla fighters do. Yes, when they're ordered to. Whereas I forbade her from leaving camp. Indefinitely. Okay, um, All right, what can we do? so you've got a problem. Insubordination. What am I supposed to do about it? I doubt Vess has entered the village. More likely she and the boys lie in wait in the woods nearby. We must find her before she attacks and stop her. You're a good tracker. Help me. Hmm. Count oh. me in. Thanks, Geralt. I'll owe you a favor. Meet me and Velen beneath the hanged man's tree. It's just a short jaunt from there to Mulberdale. Okay. Oi, clumsy arse. Oi, oi, fuck off, you twit. Is there anywhere we can kind of... Yeah, hang, hang around the tree, there we go. We can travel there. The Lodge of Sorceress is a secret political cable made up of the most powerful temple uh, female magic wielders in the world, not the temple. Hey, 
Here we go. Looks like they've left. It's the village below. Black with Nilf guardians already. They're preparing to execute folk. No sign of this. Well, she may be impetuous, but she's not stupid. She's waiting for her moment. Probably attack after dusk once. Shh. What now? A trio, lightly equipped, sneaking closer. Over there, near the. Set to the black ones! At me, Circa! Looks like we're too late. Hmm. Follow me. Well, this is time for the steel weapon. And this is also going to be time for Axie. This is a bit of an idiot. We should be able to kill a few of these fuckers. Oh, that was a good swipe. I believe we just took out three of them in one swipe. I mean, this is the problem with leaving the quest until later on in in the story. He hit quite hard, actually. Spike bolt, there we go. Okay. These spike bolts, I'd imagine they're going to be quite uh, expensive. Oh, we should probably stop looting and help. Oh god. There we go. Oh, god damn now. it, Bess. Have you gone completely mental? You ignore my orders, go off on a suicide mission, and instead of donning a breastplate, you dash into battle, mm. shirt open, navel and what not exposed. You're not my father, Roach. You've no right to tell me what to wear. But I am your commander, and you will obey me. Guerrilla warfare. Warfare! It involves armies, for fuck's sake. I could hmm. not abandon them. They helped us. It's a soldier's job to kill, Bess, not save, not rescue. If that is not to your liking, join the Sisters of Militalay. Hmm. Study to be a healer. Fucking hell. Give me your weapon. You'll get it back when you wise up. If you wise up. Move out! <coughs> 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 Hmm. Uh -oh. You got a prisoner. Got yourselves a prisoner. We don't take prisoners. You took my weapon, Roach. So I must manage with my bare hands. Leave him alone. Hmm. There are corpses enough here. What? You heard me. I did, and I can't believe it. He came here to murder civilians. He's seen us. Will you have him return to his camp and report? Emir knows we can kill his men. Let him learn that you can also show mercy. Roach, noble of you and all, but occasionally I work for I, the I've Guardians. Got Frankly, I don't want any trouble. I don't like this. But so be it. You certainly don't deserve to suffer as a result. Well said, Geralt. A good black one's a dead mm. black one. I'll strangle the bugger. Stand aside. I'll do it. Nen, Trokai. There we go. Oh, so it. Uh, we should go before a patrol comes along. Thank you, Geralt. Ever need any help? You know where to find me. Well, we do. So please don't walk away. Please, please don't, please don't, please don't. Where are you? Where are you? Have you already run off? You've already run off. We already have helped him against this. So I hope we can kind of just get there. Ooh. And he will, you know, just help us out, right? Show me what you got. Oh, you fucking stupid horse. Don't know why we ran all this way, because now we're running away. Okay, here we go. Here's a fast travel point. 
We're in Devil's Pit, and we need to go to Tamerian Partisan, right, hide out. I'd much rather the Tamerians lead than Emre. Because Emre is just a pit, just a bastard. Okay, let's see what we can do. I love burning my shelf, I do. Safe and sound. Well, let's Could ask you your help at Kaer Morin. Aim to take Ciri there. Wild Hunt's bound to appear soon after. You didn't turn your back on me when I was in need. It's only fair I do the same. Thanks. Venture to say your skills might prove invaluable. I'll consider hmm. whether to bring Vess. Either way, I'll see you at Kaer Morin. Thank you, mate. Well, there we go, guys. Uh, we're going to end the episode here. Obviously, uh, as you can tell, we've now got... Um, Emir won't help, which is kind of good, I guess, because if we'd have had him, how would we have ever had, how would we have ever had these guys help? That'd have been torture for them. So we've gone with the right people. We've got ourselves uh, Zoltan, uh, Vernon, sorry, Vernon Roach, and uh, we've got ourselves Hero Metz. And we've just we've worked out that they won't help us. So now we're going to have to go and talk to Zoltan, talk to Dijkstra, talk to Triss and uh, see if they will help us and then we'll move back on to Skellige where we also have a few more things to do over there so, and then eventually in a few episodes time we will be able to fuck up the Wild Hunt and fully save Suri for good so thanks guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed if you did you know what to do hit that like button subscribe if you're new around here tell your friends about the channel leave a comment or a question if you have anything in the comment section below and the links are in the description for my Twitter and my Twitch as always thanks guys and 